Hi kids. Welcome to the channel Prizzling Treasures. Let's get into today's story. There was a beautiful forest on the top of a mountain and close to the clouds. In that forest lived a lot of happy animals. They lived together in harmony and with no hate towards each other. Each animal was beautiful in their own way and even if some of them were different from one another they accepted them exactly the way they were These animals were not aware of humans and the destruction that their indifference in nature could cause but one day everything changed A hunter made his way up the mountain and started setting traps the animals that saw this did not really know what the hunter was doing since they have never seen a human or a trap but they just knew that the trap was a dangerous thing and they would have to tell all the other animals in the forest to stay away from these shiny things with the big teeth lion the king of the jungle held a meeting and warned every animal to be careful one animal that never listened to the king was the fox he would just go his own way and do whatever he wanted one day while playing in the forest the fox saw a shiny object in the grass because he did not listen at the meeting he did not know that he was supposed to stay away from the trap he slowly moved closer sniffing here and there something smelled really good and he was getting hungrier by the minute when he got closer to the trap he saw a big chunk of meat just lying there this is my lucky day I do not even have to work hard to find any food for today the fox thought to himself happily fox moved closer and closer he opened his mouth and could really taste the meat when clunk snap the trap closed luckily fox was still young and could move quickly but oh dear He was not fast enough. His tail was stuck in the trap. Help! Help! Fox shouted. I am stuck. Get me out of here. Ouch! It hurts a lot. Unfortunately, no animal was around to hear Fox moan and groan because they all listened to the king when he told them to stay in their houses. until the hunter was gone he pulled and pulled and at last he freed himself but when he wanted to have a look and see what his tail looked like his tail was gone there was the tail still stuck in the trap he pulled so hard he broke his tail off the fox felt very shy now because he realized The other foxes and animals are going to laugh at him and it was all his own fault because he did not listen to the king. The fox did not want anybody to laugh at him so he came up with a plan. I will just act as though it is much more fun not having a tail and that way people will think I am very happy with my new look. The other foxes started laughing at him because he looked so funny. But they stopped laughing when he told them, "This is the best thing that could ever have happened to me. I am so happy without a tail." He even told them that he can run much faster. Most of the foxes thought about this and wanted to go to the king. and ask him to remove their tails too but one very clever old fox said you are lying 
You are just pretending to be happy so that we all lose our tails and you will not be jealous any more. A fox must have a tail but it does not mean that if you do not have a tail you are not a fox any more. So why do you lie and say you are happy when you are not? You know in this forest we accept one another no matter what you look like. The fox felt very shy again and started crying. I'm so sorry for pretending to be happy when actually I'm sad. He said through all his tears. The old fox gave him a hug and asked him why he felt that he had to lie. I was scared you will not accept me because I am different from you now and I wanted to pretend that I'm something else. so that you will accept me the old fox sighed and said it did not mean that if you are different than us you need to lie love yourself for who you are and accept yourself and the other foxes will also accept you even you look a bit different from that day onwards the fox stopped telling lies and started being real it realized that being true to itself is way better than pretending he also understood that the life is an unpredictable adventure and facing the consequences of our own actions adds a thrilling twist to the plot from then on all the animals in the forest started living happily ever after Glad you tuned in. Love the story? Smash that thumbs up, leaving your cool comments. Subscribe and share with your squad. More curious? Hit the magical bell button. See you soon with another exciting tale. Bye bye.